guys, Isaac Roy 2090 here. Today, going to be starting my model collection videos. So yeah, today, I'm, well now, I'm going to start up, I'm going to be doing my model fire engines. So, first off, we have, what's it called? First off, we have, well, we've got fire engines already out of um, package. And we have the Bedford RLHZ Green Goddess. Looking very nice indeed right here. Got the base. And all that jazz. And here we have the AC Regent III or three. For London Fire Brigade it says. P U C I C no not I C I six two. Looking very smart indeed. The wheels move on here, as you can see. I don't think these wheels will move, um, or these, or these ladders will move, because it's just a model. Um, also, here, I think it came with the, I think it came with the AEC region 3. We have something very special, we have um, a keyring here. Get this out of package. This is very authentic. And yes, it must have done because it is um, a keyring of the AEC Region 3 itself. Um, these came up Atlas Editions. I can't tell you the price because honestly, I don't know. I think there's something else. I'll show you as well. I'm going to have a look see if there's any leaflets that I have missed. Because I'm doing. Um, well, that's one thing that I've missed. Anything else for the fire engine specifically? There was a light of um, manuals. Oh, and there's those. So let's put these models back on now. I'll be making a video on them later. And where's my phone? Right. So, yes, we also have um, some little booklets on the green goddess. For classic fire engines, a couple pages. Get some specifications here. So stop speed was 65 miles per hour. And um, here we have the AC Regent 3. Um, this will be all the same stuff, really. And this is. Oh, this doesn't say why it's top speed was. Hmm. And it says, thanks to. On here, it says, thanks to Ronnie Cameron, Clive Barker, Ken Ride, Peter Barkley, Peter Edler, Ian Stubbs, Dave Stickland, Andy, Andy Daly, Lloyd Rich, and www.acsouthfall.co.uk for their photographs, information, and invaluable help. Uh, and for this one, um, thanks to the London Fire Brigade Museum, the Cold War Society, Pete Reed, Paul Rankin, and MSA Gallet for their photographs, information, and invaluable help. We also here have the story of the fire service. Whether it's dealing with small domestic incidents, road traffic collisions, or handling major national emergencies, we've all had to cause to admire to the, cor the courage and professionalism of the British Fire and Rescue Service. For its formation, formation through to the, through to the, I can't read. Fruit of Corn Davis, the fascinating story of the people, their equipment, and their vehicles. You'll see and hear about their, about this, about how the service has developed from rudimentary beginnings into the thoroughly modern fire and rescue units of today, and inspect fire appliances, old and new. Program features fascinating rare archive footage, new interviews with fire service historians and experts, training with the Urban Search and Rescue USAR teams, interviews with servicing fire. Serving firefighters, a look at NFS watch room reconstruction and modern fire control, fire appliances past and present in motion, including a Dennis Light for a New World, a Bedford AFS Green Goddess, which will be a bit different from that, and USAR's four wheel drive prime mover from Man, 
a working and a working 1904 strand mason steamer and an 1889 manual pumping operation with other highlights including powerful archive films of the fire service in action throughout the years the story of the fire service is an entertaining and inform informative record of a great british institution and that is 79 minutes long and that's got color and black and white so yeah this is on this is this is untouched here. Yeah. Let's get this out of package. Ooh, it's going to get the pain. Hoping the camera does not cut out on me while unboxing the DVD. So, yeah, now we've got a bit of a grip here. Let's pull that off and peel the rest. So that we can have a look at the inside. So yes, this is completely new. I've had it a while now. And let me just put that down for a second so I can show you on the inside. So yeah, we've got the disc right here. Very dandy looking indeed. And you've got some text around the side. Just talking about any unauthorized use. And then we have the front cover here. So yeah, one of my longer videos today. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed what you see. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, and yeah, that's it. I'm about to do another one now. So I will see you later. And this along with my other videos I've been recording this week will hopefully be recorded soon. So thanks for watching. And bye guys.